I'll never I am support a Palestinian them. myself. Then I will I'm tell you, I will never face. support you. Yeah. I will tell you to your and face. And you want my, you, you want, you you want want my cousin to die. Medea Benjamin with human rights organization Code Pink posted this video on X Wednesday. It shows Tennessee Congressman Chuck Fleischman in a heated argument with pro-Palestine activists. The Jewish people will never you suffer are not again answering under, the question. under Palestinian terrorism, under Hamas, under Hezbollah. So what about Israel 30, will be secure Less than 24 hours later, it has millions of views and a lot of mixed opinions. Fleischman released a statement Thursday following the viral video, saying in part, quote, I passionately and forcefully defended Israel's right to self-defense following Hamas's evil October 7 attacks that left over 1,200 innocent people dead and hundreds still kidnapped by Hamas and their Palestinian supporters. Edward Ahmed Mitchell with Council on American-Islamic Relations says Fleischman should have shown remorse in his follow-up statement rather than back what he said in the video. It is never too late to do the right thing. Congressman Fleischman should apologize for the hysterical way in which he dealt with this interaction. He should apologize for the dismissive and, and arguably genocidal comments he made about the existence of a Palestinian state and a Palestinian people. But Michael Zick with the Jewish Federation of Greater Chattanooga says he is appreciative of Fleischman's support of Israel. We're appreciative of his support of Israel and the Jewish people. Look, we've seen so much anti-Semitism and hate that's really bubbled up and it's and it's not that we didn't know that anti-Semitism exists, but it, the intensity now is overwhelming.